Hi, welcome to this edition of Digital Discoveries. And this is probably going to be our shortest episode ever, but I wanted to show you uh, one of the really cool apps that we've, uh, that we've put on our TLI grant uh, iPads for secondary students. This is for our middle and high school students. So if you're a teacher that's in the TLI program, at secondary level, you've got this app on your student uh, iPads, and the iPads are being rolled out right now, so uh, you, should, uh, you should be getting them. This app is called Brainstormer, and it's a really great app to get students thinking about um, uh, writing prompts, how to get them going. Sometimes kids can't come up with good ideas for writing prompts, and that's what Brainstormer is all about. So let's go ahead and look at Brainstormer. I've got, uh, I've got my iPad up here, and the, I, the, um, the Brainstormer app is, you can, if we go by the, code, the little grid here, it's going to be down on the third row. It's the fourth one over. It looks like a little, uh, it looks like a little, um, oh, a biplane where the guy's uh, standing on the biplane wings. And so that's Brainstormer. I'm going to turn it on here. And look what happens when you come up with, with uh, the brainstormer wheel there. What happens is it gives you three different uh, uh, types of uh, uh, things to look at for students to start brainstorming writing ideas. And some of them are goofy when you, when you do it. Some of them are really neat when you come up with it. But the whole idea here is that if a student stuck, doesn't know how to start writing, doesn't have an inspiration to start writing, they can use the brainstormer to just uh, give them some goofy, sometimes they're goofy ideas, sometimes they're not. So let's see how it works. Let's go back to our screen here. So what you have here is um, uh, three wheels. And there's an inner wheel and, uh, and then uh, two outer wheels. And so you can tell from the, the inner wheel what each one is. And uh, it might tell you a place. The place is out there on the, the far right. So I, I'm going to roll it there. You can see that one. That tells you where a location might be taking place. Right here in the second is uh, kind of a description of either where, uh, of uh, uh, who's doing it. Who's, so here's where it's at. Here's what they're doing. And here's the kind of story that's taking place. So, so you can actually even roll these. I'm doing it with my finger here. You can actually roll these to where you want. So you can like spin it around and it can actually Okay, so there's a, a disaster in a secluded shield. I don't know what that means, so maybe I'm not really good with that, so I want to spin the second one. So a disaster, so that's the kind of uh, story I'm going to write about. A naval disaster, okay, and I don't know exactly what shield is exactly, so uh, at a UN conference. Okay, so it, they're talking about a disaster, a naval disaster in a UN conference room. So that's the brainstorm to get them going. So you're like, ah, that's kind of cool. So you can actually re-spin all of these you want with your fingers if you want. You can, okay, so here's, um, here's the pursuit of Da Vinci in hell. Isn't that, that, isn't that an interesting way to start uh, a, a story, or a, that's the, the way that story goes. Now, uh, kids can move those around all they want. They can move it back and forth, but what's really cool about it is that you can have it do it randomly, too. You, there's a little picture of a pair of dice up on the upper left-hand corner, and if you click on the dice, it goes around, and there we have an Arctic invention in the kitchen. Wow, what could that be? What could we start doing with that? And then you can roll it again. We're rolling it down. Let's see. Uh, a competition that takes place in a Beverly Hills mansion. How's that for an interesting way to start thinking about a place for a story to go? So there's, uh, that's, that's basically all Brainstormer is. There's two different ways to look at Brainstormer. One is the, these wheels that are in it. But the other way, whoops, let me go back here a second. Ah. Sorry, I'm zooming back out. I'm going to the wrong place. Sorry. So you can actually even have it look like um, uh, like that. Uh, so you can have the wheels, or you can have it look like a, a slot machine kind of thing, where you can click on the the dice again, and here we come up. So Cockney Self Preservation General Store. So there's your start starting place for a story. You can click it again. Maybe that doesn't float your boat. So look at that, a reunion, a cult classic reunion that takes place at a mill. So this is a great way to get our students thinking about uh, 
place settings and the topics for writing stories. So if you're, you have an assignment where your students are asked to write short stories or they're asked to write even longer stories, they might think about using Brainstormer um, on their iPads in their TLI, uh, uh, TLI um, uh, schools. And uh, this is a pretty easy app to, to find out how to use, all you gotta do is click the buttons and it starts going, it's a great little app. So I hope you enjoy it. There, I'm gonna go start writing about my urban flight on a fishing boat right now. Thank you for joining me for this edition of Digital Discoveries. Happy brainstorming. Woo!